Backyard Brains introduces the two-channel EMG Spiker Box. EMG is the acronym for Electromyography, which is the technique for recording electrical activity in muscles. With the two-channel EMG spiker box, you can still do all of the classic experiments we created for one-channel EMG spiker box, such as recording from small muscles, capturing single muscle action potentials, and investigating muscle fatigue through EMG. But now, with the two-channel EMG spiker box, you can record electroactivity of two muscles at once. That's right, not just one, but two! Once you have your two-channel EMG spiker box, where do you start? Head to BackyardBrains.com and open up the Getting Started with the Two-Channel EMG Spiker Box Experiment. We're going to learn about muscle physiology by investigating antagonistic pairs. These are two opposing muscles that work in coordination to flex and extend a body part such as your arm. In this motion, our primary antagonistic pair is the triceps and the biceps. Biceps and triceps located. To get started with our experiment, we'll begin by placing our sticker electrodes on the bicep and connecting the black and red cables from one channel. Then place the patch electrodes on the tricep and connect the black and red cables from the other channel. Then stick an electrode on the back of your hand and connect both of the white cables to this one. This will serve as the ground signal from your body. Once you are all set up, it should look like this. Next, we'll have to hook up our speaker and the computer so that we can hear and see our EMGs. Then plug in your electrode cables, making sure not to mix up your colors or channels. Then turn on your EMG spiker box. Turn up until you can hear activity from both channels. Next, open up the Back Your Brain Spike Recorder software. This is available for free on BackYourBrains.com. Or if you don't have a computer handy, you can always use the Back Your Brains app on your smart device instead. Now we're set up and ready to observe the EMGs from these two muscles. When you wave, they alternate contracting or relaxing to move your arm back and forth. In this antagonistic pair, during extension, the biceps play the antagonist and the triceps the agonist. The agonist is the muscle that contracts, initiated by electrical spikes that we are able to observe in its EMG, highlighted in green. The biceps EMG shows no spikes, as it is relaxing to allow it to elongate. During flexion, the roles reverse. The biceps are now the agonist, contracting to pull the forearm towards the body, as is evident with the impulses visible in its EMG, highlighted in orange. As we saw before, the opposing muscle, in this case the triceps, are relaxed. With the Back Your Brain Spike Recorder software, we can see the EMG of Jasmine's bicep on top of the screen in orange, and the EMG of her triceps on the bottom of the screen in yellow. When she extends her arm, we see action potentials in the EMG of her tricep, showing that it's contracting to conduct this movement. Therefore, this is the agonist muscle in this movement. Coordinating two or more muscles in this way allows us to perform all sorts of graceful movements, and not so graceful ones too. With the two-channel EMG spectrum box, there are endless possibilities for you to create your own scientific experiments using your muscles. We've observed in some movements such as pull-ups and push-ups, the agonist muscle doesn't alternate with the direction of movement. This is because of the consistent directional downward force of gravity that is engaging the muscles. Throw in a hand clap to spike up your bicep EMG. It's a lot of fun to experiment with other movements. You have over 600 different skeletal muscles in your body you can investigate. Get creative! Or hunt out another antagonistic pair and test your hypothesis by observing their EMGs during movement. Do they alternate spiking? You can also observe that your brain is telling muscles to contract even when you're just standing still. Beautiful balance. Don't forget that you can also record EMGs from two different people at once. Try hands-free arm wrestling competition. Who can keep their spikes up the longest? We hope you have fun exploring your muscles, electrical activity, and their relationships with each other using the two-channel EMG spiker box. What will you discover about muscle physiology? Let us know. Backyard Brains, neuroscience for everyone.